Hey everybody, what's going on? It's Mr. Hino with Mr. Hino's LEGO Robotics. Well, if you checked out a few videos ago, I did um, a video on the tractor pull with the LEGO EV3 Mindstorms robot. So I told you I would show you some clips from my class. I got so excited today, I didn't even take video of it. But I have the video and I actually have um, the robot I had in that first video. Um, to show you as far as what is our current record right now for the tractor pull. So I'm going to move my robot out of the way and I'm going to show you the one from today. All right, so this one is, it's pretty simply built. Um, and this uh, robot I'm going to show you right now, we figured out how to do this. I didn't want to add anything extra. I mean, if you think about it, um, if we add more surface area, it's going to be a little tougher to pull. So we decided to just empty out a tissue box and put um, the, the motors inside there. So I actually have, um, I had 23. I took some out so we could actually gradually put them, put them back in. So here's what I got. Um, I had 23, so if I take out five, okay, so we have 18 large motors right here. And so what I'm going to do is have um, this robot pull it. If it can get past that line again, then we'll add another in there. Um, what we want to do is get to the point where this robot can't pull them anymore. Um, this robot actually started to shake violently today. Um, so if this robot can't stay on the table, that's going to also be its limit. So that team will either have to just quit and say that's the best we can do, or maybe modify their robot to be a little stronger. So here we go. This is going to be, let me get up here. This is going to be 18. All right, here we go. And look at that. Did that like a boss. Okay, so we're gonna take this back. We are gonna add in another large motor. So we were at 18, here's 19. Heck, let's get greedy. All right, that's going to be 20 right there. I just don't want to waste your time, guys. Here we go. And there we go. Do you see how it started to shake already? All right, so that's 20. Let me bring this on back. Do you see how like far off the line this thing's going? I'm going to maybe try to center this a little better. All right, so we have 20. And this is going to be 21. This is where I know we're starting to push its limit. So that's really heavy. If you've ever carried 21 large motors, you can you know that's heavy. All right, so here we go. 21 large motors. CSR, CSR starts starting to shake. And it's off the table. Okay, so that was 21. That's probably going to be its limit right there. Um, it's not able to stay on the table and successfully get past that middle line there. So if we take it out, let's just double check this one again. So right now we have 20 in here and I think that might be its limit. So there's 20. Here we go. See how it was starting to shake again. So 20 and we'll give this robot one more try at 21 just so you can't say we never gave it another shot I'm gonna start it over here because it's starting to it always seems to move this way all right here we go last chance robot at 21 so it's starting to shake and head this way all right we'll stop that 20 is the max I'm gonna get my robot now let's try mine Okay, everybody, I am back with my robot here. If you remember from the previous video, it's geared down. So let me go over here and show you how that small gray gear is hooked in out to this larger gear. Whether that will be a difference, we will find out. So I'm gonna start off like this other robot did with 18, and then we'll move up and see how I do, okay? So this is gonna be 18 large motors. Yeah, like a champ. Not even breaking out of sweat. Okay, so he crosses the middle with 18. Let's add some more. 
and I'll uh, I'll go up by twos. Not that I'm being cocky or anything, but you guys just want this to go faster, right? Okay, so that's 20 right there. That would tie the record of that other robot. So here we go. 20 large motors. Woo! Like a champ, no wobbles even detected. All right, so we tied the record of that other robot. Now let's see if we can beat it. All right, so that was 20. Let's just go up by one to 21. So this would be to beat the other robot. Here we go. Get over that line. Yeah. 21 large motors. Okay. Yes, we are going to move on. This would be 22 large motors. If you guys could just feel how heavy this is. I'm shocked. That's a lot of weight right there. All right, so 22 large motors. Here we go, robot. Oh yeah, like a champ. 22 large motors. I don't think he's even breaking out of sweat yet. Okay. Come on. This guy can't really do 23 large motors, can he? I don't even know if I got room for this. Okay, right there. 23 large motors. I know you guys are thinking, when is this robot going to quit? Here we go. Oh, I think it just met its match. No, I don't think this guy's going anywhere. And he's like, oh, I am in trouble now. Okay, guys. So officially for this video, we did 22. We could not do 23. And then this robot here, its record was 20. So once I start to get more robots, I'll do another video to show you what we're pulling. But if we can't beat 20, then there is your champ right there. So, well, I guess mine doesn't count. I did gear down, which is a little unfair, but my students can learn about uh, some gear, gearing down to uh, give them a little bit more torque there. All right, guys. Hope you found that interesting, fun, entertaining. Um, so I'll see if I can show you more videos if we have any groundbreaking, cool, neat robots to show you pulling more weight. All right, guys, until then, I am Mr. Hino from Mr. Hino's LEGO Robotics. I am out.